Welcome to Book Talk. True friend by Kirsty Applebaum. Briefly describe what happens in the book without giving away too much of the story. So it's basically about a girl who gets bought a robot friend called a Jensen and Jensen True Friend Mark 650 IV, but she calls um, Ivy, and then they re- and then the girl realizes that Ivy actually has human feelings, not just feelings supposed to look like human feelings. There's True Friend Robot called Ivy and she goes on this adventure with her human friend who is called Sarah and they travel around and Ivy learns a lot about human life. Ivy um, doesn't know that she actually has human feelings and she thinks she's just a robot trying to be caring and nice. But actually, through the story, you'll find out some surprising things. Do you think the author had a message, and if so, what was it? I think it was that... um, I don't think they had a a really um, particular message, but I think it was about that things aren't just what they seem. I think the message was that everything has feelings and we should learn to respect them. Who was your favourite character and why? So I quite liked Sarah because she was quite kind and even though at first she didn't really see the point of having the robot, in the end she's really nice. What was your favourite? Um... I liked the dad because the dad was very fun and um, I liked how Ivy called him Rob Dad. My favourite character was Ivy because she's the main character of the book and I really like how she learns all the different things about human life. My favourite character was Ivy even though she was a little bit, even though she's a robot with all this knowledge, she was a little bit, not like dumb, but she was a little bit kind of... Because she's not human, she stole money from someone because Sarah said, oh, it doesn't matter because it was from her parents. So she didn't really compare those things as well. So I think um, and she was quite funny because that she was so literal. I really enjoyed the book because it's not a normal book that you find on a shelf every day. And did you enjoy the book? Yes, a lot. I did too. It was very gripping. Would you recommend it to a friend? Um, yes, I would. For sort of like upper school. Yes. I would definitely recommend it to a friend because it's really good and you should definitely read it. I would because I think that it's just a really good book. If well you then, would you like to have a book? Could I be or what could I be? Probably, I would not like to have the Jensen Jensen True Friend Mark 650 IV um, because it's not really human and um, it can't really do as much as a human can. And also, a human can really give her opinion, whereas a robot would just say what would make you happy. Um, I think I mostly agree with Tobias. I would definitely not have one because I feel more special when I have a real friend and having a book I know that is made to be good and kind to me but I like a friend who actually likes me and wants to be with me and to be good friends not just someone that is made to be with you. Marks out of ten? I would do ten. I would do nine out of ten. I say ten. I say nine and a half. If I had a message, it would be to not stop writing your stories in this style because it is amazing.